So by now you may have heard of the serial predator, David Pierce. He was taken in by police in LA for suspicion of homicide. Because he and his two accomplices dropped off these two women, Hilda Marcella and Christy Giles, essentially DOA at two separate hospitals in masks and an unlicensed vehicle. And the girls were overdosed on something that they never had a history of doing. The DA must have not had enough evidence to get the homicide charges to stick. So David Pierce is currently in jail for four SA charges, which he's being arraigned for on Friday. What's crazy is one of my followers reached out to me and she had an encounter with David Pierce within a few months from when what happened to Hilda and Christy happened to them at an LA event during award season at a very nice hotel. I'm not giving identifying details because the girls are scared it can get back to them. So essentially what happened is these two girls clicked and then he absolutely insisted on giving them his number and exchanging numbers and harassed them even though they did not want to exchange numbers. And then when he got her number, he called and texted her literally nonstop and wanted them to go home to his apartment after the party, just like Hilda and Christy did. And then when they didn't, he continuously berated them for not joining him and his friends and was just nonstop calling and texting to the point where they had to block him on the phone. Um, and even though they didn't leave with him, he was doing this all night with other women and some women did leave with him. So anyway... Understandably, the women that this happened to were incredibly shaken up when they saw on the news that the guy that was harassing them at a party shortly before, um, you know, was being taken in for suspicion of homicide with two women who ended up accepting his invitation to go back to his apartment, which seemed like, at least for these women, more of a harassing and very pressured situation. And he deserves to be behind bars for life.